So now let's say I've got this street the way I like it and I want to make sure I save it and can access it again later from anywhere. So I need to create a project to store it in. So I come here to the control center as we were before. I go to the login register tab. You can see that I've already created a whole bunch of projects. Um, so I type my email in. When I do that, if I hit load all, all of my projects, then it will populate this list with all of my existing projects. I can add it to an existing project using this box or I can create a new project for it and the way you do that is you click here to register new projects and on this box you just start filling in things. So now I filled it all in, email, my name, everything. Uh, this abbreviation, if you hover over this, it tells you that whatever you put as the abbreviation becomes part of the URL for where your projects are located and where your streets are. Um, project password, I usually just make it the same as the project name, um, just for convenience. Um, if you do this look me up autofill, if you've already registered other projects, then you can push this button and it'll just fill this in. We'll go to next. Here you can uh, upload a project logo, your company logo or organization, or if you have a special logo for the project, you can upload a logo that way, and it'll place it on the um, up here on the top. And then you just have to put in the sum of the math formula here, which would be 11, and register project and log in. So now you see that I have this test one project with one street in it. So now all you have to do is come back and log in and, and you're back to working on this on another day.